Hello, this is Tim Carter for Kawasa with an overview of the multifaceted and musically inspiring amplification simulation suite, Amplification One. Amplification One is both user-friendly and very fun to use. You will find limitless ability to shape tones ranging from warm, jazzy cleans to extreme percussive gain all in one plugin that's easy on your processor and your pocketbook. With eight amp sims, five preamp models, five cabinet simulators, including an impulse loader, five microphone models, and much more, Amplification One becomes an irreplaceable tool in today's modern professional or home studio. Let's take a look inside and listen to some examples of the nuanced versatility that Amplification One can bring to your guitar tone. Amplification One is VST and AU compatible for PC and Mac and also provides 96,000 Hz sample rate support. It's important for proper signal quality and minimal latency that we have a solid USB or FireWire interface going into our computer and routed to our DAW. Next to the input parameter we have the preset section where you can save your created presets individually or allocate them to banks for total recall of multiple presets. Here we can turn the effects and tools on and off individually, which also removes them from the graphic interface. There is also a total bypass switch. There is a very musical noise gate in Amplification 1 that accents tight palm muting that can also be dialed back to allow delicate phrasing. Next, we have the preamp section with five different overdrive and distortion units, ranging from bluesy grit, tube boost, high gain, and a very thick classic fuzz. In the center, we have eight amplification emulators, each having their own unique characteristics, but all of them being versatile enough to be tweaked with preamps, different selections of cabinets, mics, and equalization to achieve almost any tone. Directly above, you can choose tube characteristic types, which enhance or diminish brightness and gain saturation. I want to spotlight the custom amp for a moment as it's one of the most versatile amps in Amplification One. Custom is unique in that it has a tone stacking and output function. The tone stacking option is essentially 19 different equalization settings. Each selection will affect how the lows, mids, and highs are voiced on the custom amp EQ. Scrolling through, you will hear EQ dynamics that are darker, brighter, or have a more enhanced midrange. The output section to the right simulates characteristics of different transformers. Scrolling through, you may hear differences in focus and saturation of gain. The Amplification One amplifier arsenal ranges from the boutique dynamics of the custom, black, and chrome amps to the vintage tones of beige, amber, and sunburst to high gain and lead tones in emerald and scarlet. You will find it quick, easy, and fun to dial in a great tone with these amp sims. On to the cabinet simulators and impulse loader. There are five different cabinets, two 1x12s and three 4x12s. There are five different microphone types, including a Dynamic 57, a Dynamic 421, a condenser, and two ribbon mics. Mic placement is accomplished by moving the microphone icon around the body of the speaker. This allows you to hear the cabinet and speaker characteristics and how the microphone reacts sonically to those characteristics. Additionally, there is a mic distancing tool for simulating air movement and bringing out the unique imprint of a cabinet impulse. There is a choice of microphone angle and also a phase inversion tool that inverts the wave shape orientation. A very important tool in getting a lush or thick sound is the stereo mode switch. It simply switches from a mono signal to a stereo spread by panning one cabinet left and the other right. At the bottom, you have pan control as well as individual volume for each cabinet. If you have a collection of your own cabinet impulses, Amplification One provides a very stable quad impulse loader. There are five signal chain arrangement presets for experimenting. You can adjust the starting point of the impulse attack, Pan the impulses in stereo mode, adjust the volume of each, and of course use phase cancellation if necessary. Finally, there is the output limiter, which has the ability to compress the sound to prevent overloading. There is an overload indicator light and a global output volume controlling the total volume of the plugin. Amplification One specializes in providing a rich palette of tone shaping options with every player in mind. It's easy to jump right in and start crafting inspirational tones that will jumpstart your creativity and complement your audio mix. Let's move to some audio examples of Amplification One. I will be using a Gibson Les Paul with stock pickups. I will be double tracking with Amplification One only with no post-processing on the guitars. 